The pictures, the stories, your world. Michelle Medina, Dan Cohen, and weather with Natasha Stenbach. You're watching News 8 at 6. And welcome back to you. This morning, we are talking about the benefits of solar energy. Many new homes are being built with solar panels to help reduce the cost of electricity. Joining us live is Ashley Watkins of the San Diego Regional Energy Office. Ashley, good morning to you, and thank you for being here. Thanks so much for having us. Absolutely. And we should share with everyone, Family Solar Energy Day is coming up in September, and there's actually an entire week uh, planned, devoted to solar energy. That is September, like, 20-ish? September 20th, 24th through 30th. Okay, so let's talk about that first. What is Family Solar Energy Day, and what is Solar en Energy Week? Well, Family Solar Day is part of Solar Energy Week, as you said, and it's really just a fun, free event um, that's for families to come and learn about solar energy together. There's going to be solar demos, there's going to be giveaways, there's going to be educational talks, so it's really just a place for, for families. It may not be like a Labor Day or a Memorial Day where you plan a barbecue and you make it an event, but, you know, seriously, this is an important issue. Um, the governor said, I believe it was last week, that he wants to put one million solar roofs on homes in California over the next 10 years. And he says solar energy is key to California's environmental future. He's been a huge proponent, and he actually was instrumental in just passing a bill, SB1, which um, gives $3.3 billion for incentives and research for solar. So that's huge. I think that most of us would know the benefits of solar energy, and that is it's, you know, it can save many of us but uh, one of the things in the downside is as far as the money you don't always right. save on that initially it's still pretty expensive isn't it it is expensive but one thing that's important to keep in mind that with the state and federal incentives it'll pay for about a third of the cost of your solar system how much is it i mean the conversion to a home if you want solar paneling in your roof i mean i believe it's about what 40 50 grand or so is that no it's not quite that expensive not that anymore expensive. okay well that's good if you look, an average size system is two kilowatts, and after incentives, it can be somewhere between ten to twenty thousand so dollars. But in the long term, that's really the saving, and you know, to the environment and to other people as well. Absolutely, that's the real saving. The concept of solar energy. Last question, isn't all that new? I mean, it's been around. We have fuel cell cars. We have, you know, solar technology. But it just seems like it hasn't really caught on mm -hmm. um, as far as the implementation goes. Why do you think that is? Well, I think a lot of it has to do with what you were saying about the cost, but now that we are starting to see new technologies that are more cost-effective, incentives, tax credits that we see in our office that it's just taking off. People are calling us constantly, mm -hmm. events like um, Solar Week, um, just to have huge attendance, so um, it'll just get more and more popular. Ashley Watkins, thank you for being here, and everyone at home of Solar Energy Day, Sunday, September 24th from noon to 3, and it's at San Diego County Park. Thank you for Thank being you. here. All right. Jennifer Correa is coming up with a check of the roads, everyone. Plus, good news for drivers on the 